Okay, welcome back to my YouTube channel here at Russian River Bees. Sorry, take one. All right, welcome back to my channel here at Russian River Bees in California. This is what we have going on here. I have to get this out. They're roaring, they're making noise. You can hear them. I only got about 54% on my battery. So I gotta make this quick, efficient, hopefully. And I'll have to recharge the battery. So, a little nervous right now because it's not easy when they're wild. Wild bees are dangerous. Okay, I'm gonna put this on a tripod and see what we got. It's a little unawkward, very awkward. You see here, it's very awkward. Okay. All right, guys, let's give it a try. A little nervous here. It's not easy. Right back. Okay, this is what happened here. I had it here, and uh, somehow I tried to, I, well, I uh, clamp the uh, clamp here. And if you notice, they're flying all over the place. That was the clamp. Came out, it rolled over. And I bet my step on indeed he's gonna kill me over here. So there and here we are. So queen should be in it's opened up. I'm gonna have to even just transfer this over. But uh that's what happens. See, things happen. And it's prepared for them. So nothing alarming here. I'm used to doing bigger ones, but this is what happens when they yeah, you get a swarm and off the tree and all that good stuff. There's the smoker, everybody. You wanna use the smoker properly, you wanna make sure you got something to put it in at all times, especially these days. We have very high risk of fire. So that is what's going on here. Hold on, get my camera going. That's what's going on. Uh, whatever. That's what's going on here in Northern California. We got bees to attend to. We got a smoker. Safe, safe manner. And that's our neighbors. We do have neighbors. And that is what you do. So I got bees crawling around. I'll try to pull in my pants if I let them. Be right back and see if we can get this in here and get the queen, which I'm going to have to mark her if I can. Uh, you see, they're not really stinging me, if you notice. They're very calm to the queen, but they do get alarming and upset. Put the queen in here and mark her. Let's see if we can get her. That's the next challenge. Okay, come back and watch some more. Here in Northern California, California, Russian River Bees and honey. See you soon. Okay, I was in front of this hive here, blocking their entrance and they were starting to come after me. Hope you guys can see me here. Uh, transfer the bees here. I don't know if the queen is here, but she could be. They're calming down. I sprayed them some, I gave them some sugar water. And by the way, welcome back to California, Russian River Bees in Northern California. It's been a task. It's been very, very touchy and gooey, you know sticky but i've been working out working things out it's just a little little nerve-wracking a little bit didn't want to kill the queen don't know if i killed them yet i didn't see any killed queen i think she's in here that's what's going on here you see i wrapped these frames up with rubber bands Hopefully they'll make a home here. This is a swarm out of my hive here. And it swarmed early in the season, very early. That taught me a lesson. Check your bees early in the season. Look inside those boxes, because you never know. You might get two swarms. Where's the queen? Uh, where's the queen? Where's the queen? 
Oh, is she, is she here? Oh. <laughs> like a mystery channel, huh? Just wanna, it's all about having fun when you go to bees, even when they're all around you like this. It's something that I do, it's good healing, it's a good meditation. And that's what it looks like when bees are moving and moving around. Some have died because of the honey. I have to fix this frame up next and get it in that box. This will take two days, two or three days to do. I really thank you for watching and I'm hopefully I get some more good content on going your way here one day. We just got what we have. I mean, uh, I mean I'm listen, my mouth is dry. It's hot outside and I'm working with bees, okay? And I have a lot of stuff still to do. Which I'm not complaining, it's part of what I like to do. That's what's going on when you break a hive up, see? You know, you know they're, they're a little confused now. They, they were up there before, and now they're down here, and now they're over there. Oh, shit. Oh, I just got stung. Ah, it got me. Ah, see, told you. Ooh, that one hurt it. Oh, that one hurt it. That's what happened, see? Uh, God. Got me in the way. That's, you can't stay. You can't stay there too long. I'll get you. All right. Here you have it. <laughs> I got my. Uh, I get my immune immune shot. I don't know what do you want to call it? My vitamin shot. All right. They're acting out there. I got. You know what's coming back here? I got uh, the forages are coming back. They're more aggressive and older, so I got to start using the smoker. Uh, I'm glad I transferred them over, but. Okay. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time here. California Russian River East. March.
So that's all folks. That's the big transfer. And that's what it looks like. Sometimes they're busy bees. Busy bee. Don't forget biz.com. Soon. That's bzz.com.